Well, an interesting turn of events has happened. So in our previous episode, we started making our way to the fabled Blight Town for the second bell. And I got into an argument with a uh, gecko, which ended up with me being cursed, which means I can now fight the undead. However, it also means I have 50% of my hit points, which were still meager to begin with. So, um, this let's play might not last much longer, but coming up for you guys, we got me versing ghosts. So, that's a thing I have to have my light on while fighting these things, because I'm not good with horror stuff, and these things come out of the goddamn floor. And I just walk past them, but, um... This episode was hell. I can kind of figure out what how to fight the ghost, but the thing is that they can move through walls and I cannot. So I will be trying to trudge my way through and hopefully find a bonfire somewhere. But until then, uh, we're gonna roll the intro. Welcome back to our Let's Play of Dark Souls with me, host Yolte, and I'm going to have to rush back to that area because um, the last episode I kind of died on um, easy mobs because I decided to be dumb. So this time I shouldn't die as easily. And I'm not going to mess around as much with my weapons. Oh, those drops. Fire bombs, those are helpful. Where are they? Yes, they are. Oh, or more drops. A short sword. Probably upgrade my stuff at some point. I did get a new upgrade item, I think. Oh well. This must be the quicker way back. Let me know in the comments if this is the quickest way back to where I'm going. I need to know. But yeah, basically what happened was I messed up, didn't calculate properly, and died. Did I calculated it all. I shouldn't be doing that. Then yeah. it took three hits as well. What is this? Alright, got a plan. No, not dying, and there's only a couple of thousand souls there, so why does it matter? They don't. Um. Hmm. Yeah, just screw these guys in particular. Dare set me on fire? What the fuck? They deal more damage than I can take. What? Okay. Two minutes in. Died twice. I'll get better. I'll get better. <sighs> They're just trash mobs, they shouldn't do that. And I did miss. And run through fire, oh shit.
I didn't only swear in these. Oh well. I have to be careful with all those um, things that drop. I, I should just not have gone back. Then I wouldn't overestimate myself as much. I'm guessing I can't just parry fire, so I need to just hit them and kill them. Is it weird that the weakest enemies are the most annoying at the moment? They don't get salts, they just hurt you a lot because they do damage. Like, ugly, these guys are easier to kill because they can only hit me and die. It's okay, eventually, after you kill things enough, they stop respawning. I might start. When I'm speeding up footage, we're on a one to one every time I die so we can actually get through this game. Crap, that's what's getting me. The fact that they jump. So did they respawn? No. Two mobs that don't respawn. Good for me. No, there's more. Shut up. That's what those look like. Oh, there's a few of them. They move. Not this time. The fact that there's more than one of them makes me nervous. The fact that I saw them in advance makes me happy. Oh, that's interesting.
We're coming closer. Yes. Very much so. See what happens when you're running. It's, it's one ammo. Well. Oh crap. Oh no, oh no. Twenty stick burst. Whatever the fuck these are. We can go downstairs. Maybe firebombs will work. Black fire. So I get more fire bombs and not a problem. Oh crap, there's, there's one more. I don't know how rare fire bombs are now that I started using them. <laughs> See a lot. Not that I need to, but does this door open? What's this? Great axe. And is that a bonfire? This makes me nervous as fuck. Is that a rat king? <laughs> Fuck you. Where am I?
What does he do? Tells me to stun him? Tells me to stun <sighs> I'm cursed? Does it mean- that means I can fly things near long though, doesn't it? Who reside? Does he really exist? But don't blame me. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, this is new. Got a new lawn, though. See if I can hurt these undead because apparently that's what you need it to be in the first place. But now I've got half my health, so now I need to plan out all my moves. And now I've got half my health to do so with. Lovely. <laughs> I thought it was doing so well getting through that area and it's like, oh, I'm Nah, you're actually just gonna be cursed. What if it's only for one death? Or if you're running back and forth forever? Or is it the whole time? So we're about to find out, aren't we? Uh, this game becomes unbeatable, I'll let you guys know. Just mine. I could have fought a boss. I could have continued the game, but no, I went the wrong way. Got down a hole. Got cursed. I know you guys. Will, that's why you're watching, right? Why you guys watch this? Wait, what? I don't hit her at all. Oh, I get missing. And my Astis Flosk is basically just like useless. Oh. Whoops. <sighs> Still cursed. Have you just had that? It said it was once an under, unless the ghost. <laughs> All right. I guess we'll see you on the next episode where we make our way for a new Londo. Later.